back to hammering all that rust away. Now this is what's on the ground here. It's just from this cross member. <laughs> just uh Oh, that's a nasty job. Yeah, so I'm laying on this. <laughs> As you can see, that's what I'm laying on. Underneath and being covered with the scrap. We'll do the next cross member. This is the one that holds the torsion bars. So let's hit it. <laughs> <laughs> Let's hit it! <laughs> this is what's coming off. See the white stuff? That's all salt behind it. This is why your vehicles rot. Crazy stuff, crazy. <laughs> Gotta make sure you don't hit the fuel lines. you around guys so you can see what I'm doing here In this this is what's inside here this oh yeah nice oh. look at all this
Yeah, as you can see, this is nice sheets like that coming down from that section there. That, that hit hole in there. But look at the pile of rust. This is just... It's all rust. Big piles of it. This is from this side, this is from this side, from the frame and cross members. The MPG on this vehicle is going to improve so much because I think it's at least 100 pounds lighter. Gonna fill up this bucket. Now, of course, this is all the heavy rust. I just used the uh, little chisel. So now it's time to grind everything to nice clean metal. Unfortunately, I can't do this in my garage because it's so dusty, it's gonna cover everything. This is dusty as it is. But grinding rust, it's just, you know, it gets really nasty. As you can see, this is all rust. I got a full bucket. Oh my goodness. Easily 40 pounds. Okay, so here's the close up of the frame. See the white stuff? You can actually rub it, and if you lick it, it's just pure salt. And the black stuff here, the certain spots you see here, it's actually where the original wax was still holding on to metal. So if you scrape it, you see nice clean metal underneath but you see just a few spots here and there most of it was just uh, the original coating the salt got underneath it and just rotted everything